first little pig was very lazy. He didn't want to work hard, so he built his house out of straw. It was quick and easy to make, and he soon had a cozy little straw house. The second little pig was a bit more diligent than the first. He chose to build his house out of sticks. It took a bit more effort, but it was still quicker than the third pig's plan. The third little pig was the wisest of them all. He knew the importance of hard work and building things to last. So, he spent a lot of time and effort constructing his house out of sturdy bricks. It was a strong and safe house. One day, a big, bad wolf came to the forest. He saw the first little pig's straw house and thought, Aha! A tasty little piggy for lunch. Ha 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 ha. He knocked on the door and said, Little pig, little pig, let me in. But the first little pig was scared and replied, Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. The wolf huffed and puffed and blew the straw house down. The first little pig ran to the second little pig's house made of sticks for safety. The wolf followed and came to the second pig's house. He said, Little pigs, little pigs, let me in. But the second pig, though frightened, also refused. Not by the hair of our chinny chin chins. The wolf huffed and puffed again, and this time, the house of sticks fell down. The two little pigs ran to the third pig's house made of bricks. The wolf was determined to catch them and came to the brick house. He said, Little pigs, little pigs, let me in. But the third pig was not afraid. He replied confidently, Not by the hair of our chinny chin chins. The wolf huffed and puffed and huffed and puffed, but no matter how hard he blew, he couldn't blow the brick house down. It was too strong. The wolf gave up and went away, hungry and disappointed. The three little pigs were safe in their sturdy brick house, and they all lived happily ever after, knowing that hard work and preparation paid off in the end.